work. See Swifty getting lit on the train. Oh my, oh my, oh my get gosh. Ready to party. party gets in there. Yeah, no, we can't. We get in there. Oh my gosh. That's how we do in LA, boo. <laughs> you yeah. can't, no, wait. Uh, this is a live up video, update video, but not in the first 10 seconds, hun. Hello! Uh, I know you just went back to another video. Welcome! Yeah. Yeah. Not my channel. Guys, do you reckon I need to change the uh, channel name to yeah. Corner yeah. Corner yeah. Corner I've got a remaining independent woman hat. Until you put that remaining finger. So when I do that, you'll change the name. Who knows? Corner, I'll anyway. think about it. The Swift family. Welcome back to another video. We missed you guys so much. Look at this stunning view. Oh, We've not spoken to Angels in a really long time, actually. Can't. Welcome to a life update, everybody. Yeah, I know. I was thinking that earlier. When I was in a traffic jam, I thought like, one week ago today I was in a traffic jam for Angel Party. How fast has the time gone? I think you actually need to go to like. Like learning behaviour to stop you from burping. Learning behaviour to stop me burping. Connor, it's not even a burp. How much is that if you drunk, Connor? Eddie, whenever you talk to anyone else apart from me, you burp as you talk. Oh. Do you not agree, though? And you know you do it. I think it's just because I get nervous, Connor. Yeah, I know, but then you have to, like... Yeah, but you do things when you get nervous apart from me. You don't burp in And I don't tell you to go to learning behaviour. You do. You maybe get to hypnotherapy, mate. Yeah, but that's like a joint effort, like that's a couple's yeah, um, thing, right? Sorry, no Guys, we're not, we're not having couples today. therapy, we're just, um, you know, therapy for individuals. Because much, we yeah. like to learn and grow. On my confidence. But that's another life update story yeah, for another time. We've got so many life updates, everybody. God, I hope you can hear us all right. Okay, so basically, hello, welcome to another vlog. Um, we thought today, this we haven't a, done a real long this could be a true Ellie and Con vlog. vlog. Oh. Yeah, in a really long time. Like, we've got a lot of information to talk to you guys to about. Sit back, relax. Grab a cup of tea, get your biscuits, get, get your, your tea and biscuits set. So, oh. if you've ordered some, yeah, but it's not come yet, don't worry, honey, it's the 21st of October, will soon come around. Not too long away. Not too long. We are currently on the train on the way to London today because we have a very fun evening tonight. We're celebrating Meg's launch within the style. Can't wait. Thank so proud well of her. Done. She's done fantastic. Shout out to you, Megan Grubb. Why did you say her surname? Grubb. Go, Megan Grubb. Just... Go, Megan Grubb. Go, Megan Grubb. Go on, Ashley. <laughs> you so, do yeah. you, boo. You do you, boo. No, God. It's her COVID, right? Not ours. Yeah, but Come she's on. doing her. Yeah, to be fair, you do you, boo. We're going to that, which is really fun. Con, you've never been to an in the style party, have you? No. They're a bit crazy. Been to a Can I just COVID say? Party, no. I used to always go to them back in the day. Bloody loved it. Me, Lucy, and Anne always used to make a weekend out of it. You did it once, honey. <laughs> no, call me. No, me and Lucy did it more than once. Yeah, but you said you, Emily, and Lucy did it. Con, don't be jealous. Be real, pun. Well, me, Jason, and Niles get on it tonight. We thought we'd made a date day out of it, so we're getting the train up because we've driven up to London and back so many times recently. We're so over it, and we haven't been on the train for a while. So we thought, you know what? Let's train up. Let's get the train. We're gonna meet up. With, I think we're going to see Karis. I think James is seeing another friend. Oh, seeing James. No, Karis said he's with a, yeah, another until friend. Yeah, until two. Until two. Wow, I don't know. I'm. I'm telling you. I'm just here for the girls, right? So, all my honeys, if you feel me say, yeah, what's on the Why is that got his on there? What? His monster? Yeah, it's mine. No, wait, it's no, Con, I think it's because it's from that lovely angel that got us a monster. Aww. How funny then, because I'd already drunk mine, so I must have just literally picked up the one that says hers. Because we drink it Because we share You have an addiction to monsters, and it's bad. You stop working, and you stop drinking monsters. Yeah. Stop reading my text messages. Who's Chloe? Who's hey. Chloe? She's a manager. I'm your manager. No, you're not. Okay, yes, you are. Oh, God, you get so offended when I say that. Ellie, no. Come, come on, we're getting fifty on the train. Yeah, I am. I'm a selfie. <laughs> Doing today, guys, we're going to go shopping because. Okay, should we just tell 
more than like one of the life updates now. Should we just tell them? Yeah, <gasps> yeah, because you got you want to surprise me, aren't you? Oh, oh my god. I'm actually gonna surprise you now. Or do you want to wait? No, I want you to surprise me now. Right, tell them the update. Okay, so basically life update guys. Surprise, we're going to LA. Oops, and uh, oop. And now, uh, because obviously as you guys know, we've had a lot going on recently. Um, due Just to another twice. life update we thought we'd, um, that's happening at the end of the month, we thought we would spread our wings, go and fly. LA, LA is a trip we've always wanted to do and we're doing a little bit of a road trip as well actually. So um, we're just taking a few weeks off. If you wait to see the car, I'm going to get angels. We're not taking it off as in like vlogging. Oh, come look at us holding hands. That's really sweet. I didn't even realise we were doing that. Are we a couple girls or are we a couple girls? Are we romance or? Uh... Oh, yo, hey, I saw that way then, didn't you? We go on Monday. So yeah. we're very excited about that. We'll be gone for about two and a half weeks. We can't wait. Prepare for the LA Sunday, vlogs. Because that's when we travel. Yeah. Up yeah, you're right, Con. We're getting so an early stand, flight. I can't bloody stand, wait. So I'm a few excited for an airport vlog because I am. Yeah, that's going to be fun. And so, Connor's been going on for the last couple of days saying that he's surprising me with something in LA. Do you want to wait though? No, it's pretty I want you good. to tell me now. It's pretty oh, good. Is you it? said what you would tell me on the vlog. It's pretty good though. So, what is it? Yeah. <laughs> he surprised me. Hey guys, he never surprised yeah, this, me. This so could this be like, deal. this is like right. thumbnail. Oh, okay, we'll save it then. You just told me not to, though. You can't tell me or not. Oh, we you just told me, to not, to, you just me not to Open tell you. Not. Make your mind up. Oh, Connor, I don't know. Any tickets or passes? Yeah, oh, sorry, I've got to give our tickets. To be continued. Okay, guys, okay, we're back. Connor's agreed to tell me now. You actually want me to tell you Yeah, now. let's have the camera up. Come on. Let's make it a bit more oh. sure. So, the surprise is, the surprise is that... Yeah. On Friday, the 11th, we are going to the Staples Centre to watch <coughs> Chris Brown live. Shut up. Shut up. Yeah, I I sorted you out. I woke up Chris Breezy. <laughs> oh my god, I'm mad. And you started singing that song after I booked it, I was like, oh. Did I? <laughs> yeah, the other day. No, do you know what it was? It's because you sang it. Oh, oh my I? god, Con, I can't believe that. Really? Yeah. We love going just on concerts, don't we? Yeah, just a little surprise. Well, thank you so much. Not the best seats because it was literally sold out. London Paddington. But Boo, we can still have a dance wherever we are, even if we're sat outside the stadium. We don't care. We'll be do you know what I mean? And we love the dance. Oh my god, can't wait. <gasps> can't. He better not sing Take You Down. The next station what? is Reading. Ooh, that's so fabulous. Thank you so much. What a gorgeous surprise. Can't wait to have so much fun. We like our concerts, don't we? Yeah, we like doing anything really, don't we? Yeah, we like just making memories. What did you think it was? Honestly, I have no idea. I had no idea. Because I was going to surprise Connor with tickets to go and see the Late Late Show with James Corden. So I was like, Con, I think we might be booking the same thing. So we need to like talk a little bit. So I ended up telling him that. And he was like, no, no, that's not it. So we're just making memories out here in LA, you know? Even though we're not there yet. Even though we're not there. We're still making memories there. Oh my God, can't wait. Update. Number one. Number one. See you in LDN. I'll be learning all the new words to the new Chris Brown album. It's got my favourite song on it. Don't Looking tell her. Yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness, time for food. We literally just got out the taxi. Um, just jumped off the train. We'll be able to compare as well. England should not play. Surely we've had an American Chipotle note before. Yeah, but not this close to an English one. That's harder. Can't remember what it tastes like. We've got two servings of guacamole. I don't really know why. I, I sometimes do this thing where like I'm so hungry. 
I'm just like, oh my god, I need five servings of everything, and then it comes to eating it, and I just really don't Maybe need sometimes. it. Sometimes, it's every single day. Huh? It's not every single day, Con. It's only when I'm starving. Oh yeah, but of course you took it into it, don't you, Con? Yeah. Got my burrito bowl here. We've got cheese, sour cream, chicken, salsa, rice, pinto beans, fibre. Give me all that fibre. Eat in this vlog apparently. Come to Clapham after doing lots of shopping, guys. I've got something to tell you, uh -oh. but I will tell you when I get home. It's a purchase I made today. Look, I went to Harrods, okay? We had a great time, made a few purchases. There's a big bag down here, wonder what's in there, and then we've got a couple of little bags here. Bought lots of Charlotte Tilbury makeup, but um. We will explain that at a later date. Um, yeah, so we have spent the afternoon shopping, kind of had a look around Zara and what was the other one we went to? River Island. River Island for LA clothes. We failed to find anything, obviously because it's winter time here, it's summertime over there, so... I don't think it's summertime over there, it's just always... It's just always sunny in LA, but do you know what I mean? LA weather. So I guess so. Looking like winter for you. We are here to have some dinner to meet Karis and James. They should be here any sec. Um, we're about to go to Meg's event. And also, we're going to try to get Glastonbury tickets as well because we live local. So, we're going to try to get the coach tickets. Um, so, that's in half an hour, so let's not forget. Anyway, we've come to Clapham, which is near the area of the event. And it's where James and Karis are staying in their hotel. So, we're going to meet for some dinner before. Um, we've come to this place called Chicago Rib Shack, which looks really yummy up our street. It's a bit like grill stock vibes if you know what grill stock is. Got some lovely mac and cheese bites. Yeah, I don't really know what I'm gonna get. That is tickling my fancy though. <laughs> Hello, Carl, are you having fun at the Megan Grab launch? Hello! Oh, oh, you've not even been on the vlog today! Oh, hi! Hi, guys! Hi, hi. Angels. So nice to meet you! Hi, Angel. Hi. 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 Angels. Here are some lovely angels that we've met this so evening! Oh. So cute! So we've made it to the Megan Grub in the Style X event. Be the other half of my ex. We're being proper YouTubers today. Paris, be the other Oh, half sorry, of my is that what you were doing there? <laughs> yeah. Megan Grub in the Style X launch. <laughs> Look at this cocktail list, everybody. It's literally so cute. And the photos are so cute everywhere. Sling your heart out, Grub Gin, Megan <laughs> Mojito. Best bum rum, and then also this is so cute, Blue Bell's beer. I said to Connor when we throw an event, we're gonna have to like curvy top. Curvy, oh my god, brilliant. I'm just trying to think of one. Mila's mojito. <laughs> that does sum them up, doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, with mojito. Let's like, go through and show you guys around. Yeah, so here we have a cute donut wall. So much more. This is a very cute location, actually. It's very Megan, isn't it? Like yeah. all the wallpapers and stuff. It is. Oh my, my god, look at this iconic hun. Love it. And then through here. Wow. Oh my god, that's so cute. Meg X ITS. So cute. And look, here's her collection. Wow. Oh my god. So nice, isn't it? So silky. Oh my god, I literally love this stuff so much. This is how my living room looks when it's taken over by Connor Swift doing a fashion show for all of his new clothes that he ordered on Boohoo and ASOS for LA. Guys, oh, come on. Oh. This is the vibe he's gone for. Cargo trousers, denim shorts with yellow stripes down them. I don't know how you pull them off, Boo, because you actually do pull them off and they actually do look really good. Did you, you just said they didn't look like good just a minute ago. I changed my mind. It's going to be black shirt under here. Okay. Or black tee. Okay. That one there. Nice. Love it, fashionista. Um, good morning, everybody. Here good morning. Let me put my keys down. Good morning. I am not looking fresh today. Um, no, you look fresh today. Con, not really though, Boo. Do you know what I mean? I am up this morning because I'm going to Gemma 
at Gloss Bar. Gemma is the J Cosmetics lady that does all of my um, filler, which by the way, I literally haven't had filler for a year, honestly, in such a long time. The last time I had it was when I had my jaw done, which I ended up really not liking. Um, at the end of 2018, so it literally has been nearly a year. Oh, okay. What are we saying? Knitted tank. I like it. Is it a key or is it a send back? I, I like it. I think you should keep it. I feel like every item I have to do this for, every item. I've gone extra large on a couple of things. Which I normally am, but I just feel it's a little bit too big, you no, know? No, I like it. I don't think it is too big. Connor! What, Ellie? Oh my gosh! The whole time I have had filler, whether it's been lip filler or like a little bit of Botox in my head or whatever, um, I've always been really, really open and honest about it and that's not going to change this time. I know everybody has their opinions and some people filler is just not for some people which is absolutely fine so maybe just skip this part of the video if it's not for you but um yeah i just i'm always brutally totally 100 percent honest about this sort of stuff because i just think why not be truthful about it you know That's right, boo. so um you, you know i don't want you lot thinking i've got natural juicy lips when really when it's down really, to do the derm honey you ain't got um, lips like me have you I just... But, but it's not a competition, is it, Al? I thought you were hungover today, Con. You literally just said to me that you were hungover. We had a great time at Meg's launch last night, by the way, guys. We didn't really film that much. We didn't manage to stay too long because we had to get a really early train back at, like, half past eight. So we were really annoyed, but, um... I'm just a little bit tired today. Anyway, so today I'm having a top up of my lips because I haven't had my lips done almost... I, I'm gonna say about 18 months because you don't need well I don't need them done that often but I literally I've gone so long without getting them done I just want them topped up a little bit and also I'm getting a little bit of Botox in my head um Colin's waiting for me to comment on his new trousers that he's got on love do you actually like them? yeah that's a bit LA isn't it? yeah just walking down the street in my sixth fault <laughs> we need to watch that movie again we've not seen it in ages I'm thinking maybe why no. Long white socks and trainers. Looking good, boo. Just make sure you clean this mess up, please. Herbie, come on, clean it up. All your mess, go on. Clean it up. It's alright, darling. Look at Herbie looking at me like, Mum. Clean it up. Connor. Herbie, you've got chores to do. You can't just be a freeloader your whole life. <laughs> got to earn that pocket money. Alright, son. Got to earn that pocket money, you won't, son. Yeah, okay, that's what I'm doing this morning, and then we are going to O2 because our iPad is smashed. That's a whole other story, so we need to get oh that fixed. I, I, have the angels um, no, no, they don't know, Con, they don't know. A button that squash fell on it when Con opened the cupboard, so it smashed. it's smashed. Well, Luckily, we have insurance, so we're going to get that done today. And annoyingly, it won't be done in time for LA, but do you know what I mean? You just can't keep on top of everything in life 24 7 angels, and it's okay to chill out and not get your iPad fixed for a month, you know? Then what else are we doing today? We've got Layla's shop opening. So Layla is opening a zero waste shop in Trowbridge, which is really, really cool. It's a really big passion yeah. of hers. So we're gonna go and support her tonight. You gotta um, go to the... We're gonna go to the hospital because someone very special made an entrance into the world this morning, early hours of this morning. Um, Emily and Frank up. have finally had their little boy so emotional he literally looks like frank's double if you guys don't know who emily and frank are they are our best friends they're kind of like our what's the word common it's not your family but they're like um not distant family they're basically family but they're not if you know what i mean frank is jordan's brother so um technically but not really technically kind of like our brother and sister-in-law but they're our best friends more than anything and we literally cannot wait to go and meet him that's what we're doing today we're also gonna go and s oh my god no we haven't even done the update about the other thing um so i'm not very happy that i'm announcing it when i'm literally as exhausted as this but con would you like to say our next life update that the angels are going to be seeing today next life update angels we are moving out of this house because we are purchasing a house we have bought our first ever house. Big news. 
quite big news really isn't it in our yes. little life uh we have mentioned it on separate vlogs and we have spoke about it on instagram stories but if you don't know you surprise do know. we have bought a house we're very 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 excited um it's a new build so we are going to go and see it today because the flooring went down this week and we've actually been waiting for that for Yes. What feels like years. Um, so yeah, that's exciting. So we can show you guys around. We're not going to do like a full house tour, but we will just show you guys a few sneak peeks because we're going to be doing an empty house tour. Well, we move in, I guess. Very soon. We and we are supposed to be moving in very soon. The house is supposed to be ready, literally three days after we get back from LA. How tired we both look. I know. I know. Like I, I can't really even keep my eyes open. Oh come on, Owls. Get with it. You only live once. Come on, woman. Overall, we just have a day um, doing some bits and bobs here and there, so that's what we're gonna be doing today. Stay tuned if you wanna see more. Future ahead of us, making memories. Our only hope is to forget. And keep that passage closed for centuries. Everybody, um, got my kit on. No, I don't think we have. I don't think we have. Oh, have we? Yeah, we have. <laughs> um, so this is. Let me just focus you. Here we go. Here's the gear we have to wear. I'm literally can't believe it. Like, so I came to see it last week. I just. I, oh my god. Wow. Yeah. So we came to see this last week, and there's there's already so many different things. Con. You didn't come and see it last week, did you? It was only me. <gasps> Con, show the angels your look. Here you go, Con. Go on, you look good as a builder. He's in trend at the moment. Looking good, yeah. <laughs> Let's go in. Oh! Oh my God! See, it goes, doesn't it? It does. You just say these carpets feel nice, don't they? Oh, I'm literally so happy I went with this oh, colour carpet. Yeah. They've been fitted. Yeah. <gasps> oh my god! I'm trying not to show the angels everything because, like, do you know what I mean? Oh my god. Oh wow, I'm so happy nice. I went with these handles. Very nice. They look good. Last minute decision, these handles. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god, I don't want to show them anything. <laughs> Can you believe it, Con? It's not it's Oh, I know, I know. I know, honestly, Con. I'm so in love with it. So it is a full house in my lounge this afternoon. Because I picked you up from school, didn't I, babes? Gents, did I, go, did I do a good job of picking you up from school? So and what did we go after? Lens, what did we go and do afterwards? Or two grand with an lens. Uh, like we went and got McDonald's, McDonald's, Kentucky like Fried Chicken and a Pizza Hut. McDonald's, McDonald's, Kentucky Fried Chicken and a Pizza Hut. You didn't even know yeah. that song, so did like, you? Until I taught you it. Yeah. Am I the best auntie or what? Yeah. yeah, and we've had Jessie come over. Jessie, you having some chicken nuggets? So Jordan's just come to pick them up. Herbie's loving the company. Jessie keeps and telling Herbie to sit. Jessie say, Herbie, sit. Herbie, sit. Say, sit. Good boy, say, good boy, Herbie. Say, good boy, Herbie. What noise does a cat make? Meow. What noise does a horse make? No. No. Hey, you love horses, don't you, Jess? Let's do this. What does a Jessie make? Okay. What noise does a <laughs> Jessie make? <laughs> what? What does he say? No, he doesn't. Is that what he says, gents? Hello, everybody. Okay. Time to actually chill out. Me and Herbs. Oh, he's coming through the sun. We're gonna just have a little catch up. Um, it's been a very hectic day today. Oh, I can't remember exactly what I vlogged today, but I remember vlogging 
in the house so i know that was a little bit all over the place i was literally by the way please excuse the bruising and the swelling of my lips we're just keeping it real hun right whenever people like get their lips done they don't bruise i'm like how anyway so yeah um i apologize that the filming for the house was very like creative and like we didn't really show you very much but basically today was the first time we'd seen the floor being put down because we were told that it was gonna be put down last week i went to go and see and it wasn't um so today yeah all the floors were in there was also like a really nice frame around our door that we love we've been so excited for that to go on and just a few other little bits and pieces it's obviously not completely done yet um we're having the worktops in the kitchen changed but we won't be able to see that until we're back from la so um i really don't want to give away too much to you guys because we're going to be doing an empty house tour we're going to be doing um a few more updates in that area of our life but right now not quite the time because it's not quite ready so stay tuned for house updates but yes let me know what you guys think of the tiny bits that you did see um anyway as I mentioned yesterday when we were in London, I had a little bit of a shopping spree. I just decided to treat myself. I just thought, you know what? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna let myself have this one. You know, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go ahead and do it. So, went to Harrods and um, my main thing I wanted to pick, well, I had two main things I wanted to pick up. One of them I'm gonna show you in a second. But the other main thing was picking up some new makeup bits. So I haven't really bought any new makeup apart from a um, Laura Mercier Illuminating Moisturiser that I bought last week and I love it. Um, other than that, I literally haven't bought new makeup in such a long time. Like, you know when your makeup drawer is just filled of like half used stuff, it's all dirty, it's like, a year old like I just haven't treated myself to anything in a really long time and when I got my makeup done by Georgia for my angel party last weekend she was using all of these amazing products on me and I absolutely loved the way that my makeup looked especially my skin like one thing um that was really important to me when I had the makeup done for the angel party was that I worked with a makeup artist who really understood the sort of look that I wanted to go for which was very like just very classic me, like nothing too much on the eyes, um, but the main focus was to have like super healthy looking, dewy, moisturised, hydrated skin. So that's the look I want, wanted to go for and she literally created it so well. So when I got home from London I was like, Georgia please, can you send me a product list of everything we use because I actually want to buy it all and I literally went out. <laughs> and bought it all so i'm going to show you guys what i got a lot of it was from charlotte tilbury because georgia works with charlotte tilbury so yeah i picked up a few bits let me show you guys if you guys have tried any of these let me know in the comments below let me know how you use a few of them because some of them are a little bit like i don't really know exactly how to use them i'm not like i'm not really very trained when it comes to makeup i kind of just like put something on if i like it, i like it but first of all i picked up the charlotte tilbury magic cream Okay, so when Georgia used this on my skin, she was like, you know, it's really, really good. But I don't know if it's worth paying like the full 70, I think it's 70 or 80 pounds for the full pot. But she was like, it's really, really good. But she was like kind of playing it down. And I was like, I love this cream so much because I literally loved it that much. And I'm in need for a new moisturizer anyway. I went for the big one. So I went for the magic cream really magic i get why they've called it this because it literally is magic like i can't even explain how good this feels on my skin and then i also picked up the magic eye rescue again really really good i love those products okay next up from charlotte tilbury i picked up the like wonder foundation i picked this up in a shade i want to say seven eight eight medium that's the one i got um so i'd heard really good stuff about this uh and then when georgia used it on my skin we were talking about how like I love a dewy, really glowy look, but on some areas of my face from where I had really bad acne like a year a year and a half ago, um, there's just a very, very small bit of, not scarring, but almost just like texture, kind of. Like, it's so smooth, but at the same time, you, there's just like, just tiny bits on my jaw where you can see if you look really closely that I had acne. And I was basically saying to her that like, I hadn't found a foundation or like a base product that i felt really gave enough coverage for that while still looking like really light and really dewy and i don't know what she did but she used this and she used a few of the other products that i bought that i'm going to show you and it looked flawless so that's why i've done this because i just literally love the way it looks so much um i also picked up the matching concealer the magic away liquid concealer this is in shade three fair um, then I also picked up the Hollywood Beauty Light Wand. 
which is like a highlighter i think i think for a lot of these products this one and for the flawless filter that i also bought you can use a lot of them quite quite differently i think they all have like a, li a little bit of a different function so for the flawless filter you can use all over the face with your moisturizer you can put it on top of the foundation if you want extra coverage maybe that's what she did for me um and then with the beauty wand you can super over your cheekbones this this is more of like a highlighter um so yeah i'm gonna be giving both of those a go the thing i picked up from charlotte tilbury was a lip gloss i did want to get a couple more things um that are on my list but they didn't have them there sadly i'm gonna have a look at the airport when we go to la on monday and see if there's anything there available but i picked up this lip gloss in shade ibiza nights so um georgia used shade blondie on me which was really cute although i think it was a little bit too pink for my liking on the day so i went for this one and um I also wanted to buy the Kim, the Mrs. KKW lipstick to go with it underneath. Um, because that looked so nice. But they didn't have any of the KKW lipsticks. So I'm gonna get that at the airport. Um, a little bit more makeup, but from a few different brands. So I'd never heard of this brand before. I'm pretty sure it's like a big name in the makeup industry, but obviously because I'm not in the makeup industry, I don't know. So it's this brand called Kevin Orquan or Swan, I think. I'm not quite sure how to say it. I picked up two products from there. The first one I picked up was this. This is the Glass Glow Face Illuminator. Georgia was literally, oh my god, look at that, raving to me about this so much. She was like, look at that product. Like, it's so nice. It literally makes your face look, like, wet. Like, glowy and wet. So. Oh my god. So, yeah, she used that. Oh my god, imagine that on your face. She used that under my makeup and also like all down my chest um i did put up a snap on my instagram i was getting my makeup done by her and she just used this along with the magic cream and a few other moisturizing kind of bits and that's how like good my skin looked with just that so that was a really important one to buy for me i also picked up this the sensual skin enhancer in shade s x7 um now this is like a really thick makeup product it's almost like like the thickest foundation you've ever seen so that's what it looks like i'm pretty sure you can tell from that that it's really really thick you can use that in a few different ways you can literally mix the tiniest bit with moisturizer for like um just a like a tinted moisturizer you can also use it over blemishes it's just like a really good product to have to mix with the other bits if you need a little bit more coverage which is like the kind of thing that i need um on a few areas of my face and the last little makeup bit that i purchased was dun, 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 dun. i've literally been so excited about getting this you guys have absolutely no idea i've been seeing this go around for years now and i've always wanted it so, oh my god why do chanel bags even smell nice why does the packaging literally smell nicer than i've ever smelled in my life so i picked up the universal bronzer if you guys don't know about this i'm gonna be using it in a minute to get ready when we go out for the cinema and um for layla shop opening tonight so you guys will be able to see like a full face of all these products in a sec the next thing i purchased was a bit of a like it was a treat like it was a serious like i'm just gonna do like a like a present to myself you know you know when you need to treat yourself at some points in life yesterday was one of them it's just been so much going on in my life and um I just thought to celebrate 300k, to celebrate the launch of Angel Collection, to celebrate buying a house, I was just like, you know what? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do it. I'm just gonna treat myself. I'm just gonna do it. Oh my god! I did it! Ah! I don't have a pair of Balenciagas. Um, I've always, always wanted a pair. To be honest, I've never felt cool enough to own a pair. Then, yeah, like I said, I just thought, you know what? I'm just gonna treat myself. I'm literally in love like you guys will die over these i'm obsessed they are <gasps> oh, look at them. oh you said hello so yeah these are the ones i picked up i'm pretty sure they're the triple s i got them in a uk size three i tried on the four they looked way too big because i am a size four um but yeah they just looked ridiculous size three fits perfectly and they don't look as like gigantic clown feet so i'm so happy with them i literally cannot wait to wear them every second of every day hello in la you like presents don't you you saying where's mine is that what you're saying where's mine yeah time to get ready um i'm to try out all this new makeup i cannot wait see you guys in a sec with the finished product Go, 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 go
it's your birthday. Not it's yet, it's actually my mine first. Birthday, yeah. Um, angels, this is the look. Wow. Oh, go on then. No, wait. Go on, dude. Look at those lips. Crikey. They look phenomenal. They're very swollen, and Connor was like, can't you keep them like that? Yeah, keep and I was them. like, you keep those lips juicy. Juicy as yours, hun. Connor has the juiciest lips. I don't. Oi. <laughs> okay, I don't. you could just take the compliment, Ellie, but I don't. you know. Okay. I'm feeling ill, angels. I'm no, under you're the not. weather. Since when? Literally, can't go to LA then. <sighs> can't go to the cinema tonight then. All right. What do we do about eighty? Handbrake turn, bro. Oh my. Oh. Oh. <laughs> 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 Why did you shoot the <laughs> I didn't mean to do that sound effect. It's better than the air. <laughs> <laughs> it just popped out, I was like. I couldn't do nothing about it. <laughs> I know she can't believe you did that. <laughs> I was meant to do like a. True! <laughs> no, I know what noise you're supposed to make. It makes me laugh so much that you did that by itself. <laughs> Anyway, Joker. angels, here's the makeup look, okay? Mm. Now, I am loving those new products. Con, you know what I bought yesterday? Yeah. No, oh. you didn't recommend any products. No, I did, the uh, Charlotte Tibley. Charlotte what? <laughs> Tiltley. No, Tibley. Charlotte what? Tibley. Charlotte something, isn't it? Tilbury. That's what you said, bro. No, you said til Tibley. Tibley. Yeah, yeah, that's how you actually pronounce it, Alice. You, you, I mean, I mean, I don't blame you. It's easy. It's an easy mistake. A lot of girls get the mistake, but it's pronounced Tibley. I am literally loving those products so much. In front of my Hollywood mirror, it was just like, wow, my skin's never looked glowier. Yeah, I'm it very, very happy, with it. I'm very happy with it. I'm very happy with it. You know? Okay, so we are off to Layla's shop opening. As I mentioned to you guys earlier, she is opening a zero waste shop in Trowbridge. It's um, a topic that she's super passionate about, so I'm very, very, very proud of her. I'm very happy for her that she's finally opening it. And then we're going on date night. So we are gonna go to uh, eat some food. We've not decided what restaurant yet, Con. Nan does for me. Okay. If you come to me and ask for chicken, you'll get a fat scar in your left cheek. Have Nando's every week, sometimes on a Tuesday, sometimes on a Thursday. Refillable drinks, even when you're thirsty, in the worst way. Gonna get a Diet Coke. Wish they did a Pepsi Max. Because guess what? What? I love Nando's more, more than, than your mum mom does. does. I still need to get my snacks from Marks and Spencer's, so don't have to forget them, Con. Chalky buttons, you know. Here okay. she is. Holding up everybody. It's a Who's the shop owner? Yeah, full house up in here. Okay. So welcome to Zero Waste Trowbridge. Layla's shop. We are undressed. Yeah. <laughs> You can see it's literally just zero waste everything, oh, which is brilliant fantastic. Stuff, yeah. It's I mean, exactly what Trowbridge needed. And then you can come over here. Oh, who ate? Was that you that ate that giant salted caramel? The reserve back there. Connor. She's done a run now. She's had the chocolate. All this stuff that you can get. It's literally so cool in here. And then over there, there's a few more like homely bits. <laughs> She's found, she's so proud of her, she's done such a great job and it is literally so busy, like, out here. And then there were only two. <laughs> Where it all started, just the two of us. Well, well, well. That's crazy actually, Con, isn't it? Think about when we've got, like, kids and stuff. And then we leave them. And actually it was only the two of us that started off. That's crazy. Yeah. When they fly the nest when they're 18 years old. Yeah. I'll be crying my eyes out. You'll be saying, thank God. Thank God. Like um, so. Hello, angels. It is now the next day. We have spent um, this morning packing because we are literally just about to get on the train. Look at that bruised lip. <sighs> to go to Heathrow Airport. We're staying um, at our hotel tonight next to Heathrow Airport because we have to be at the airport super early in the morning. So we just thought that would be easiest. You and Paul, Connor's mum and dad have just come to pick up Herbie. Do you know what? I just said to Con. That was literally the first time that my excitement for the trip made saying goodbye to Herbie okay. 
you know? Usually I I'm in tears. I did get a little emotional. I wasn't going to lie. I get upset. Like, usually it's really bad for me. I can't, I really can't deal with saying goodbye to him. But this time I was like, no, Herb. Like, you have a great time, hun. We're going to LA. Um, Yeah, I'm not emotional for once, which is great. Everything's all packed and ready to go. Here we are. I've just done a little blitz around the house to try and make sure everything's as tidy as possible. I am gonna say goodbye to you guys here because we have a very, very exciting airport vlog coming on Tuesday. This week we should be back to our usual schedule of Tuesday, Thursday and Sunday. Hopefully, if everything in LA goes to plan. Also, I'm really, really excited to show you guys why we're staying. Con pulled out the bag and he said, I can book. The hotel I've always dreamed of going so yeah I'm really really excited can't wait for the LA vlog so you guys so much thank you so much for watching today's video angels if you made it all the way to the end I think we should be BFFs because this video is legit like an hour long I love you guys I literally cannot wait to see you in LA I'm sad I won't be doing like hashtag awesome vibes but I'm super happy I'm gonna be hashtag LA summer vibe you know I love you guys and I will see you in the next one bye